Hello everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with the bonus lab read. This reading is something that I'll be doing for all the signs out there. It's going to be a quick one, so let's dive into the read and let's find out what is going to be the future of this connection. Whatever connection that you have on your mind, uh, whatever connection that you might be currently dealing with, whatever it is that you want to check this read for, it can be applicable to that connection. So let's dive into the future of that connection that you have on your mind, and this reading is going to be for the sign of Capricorn. So Capricorns, let's find out the future of this connection. Um, before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it is a general read, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that resonate and leave the rest for personal reads. You can always reach out to me on my mail ID. In the description box, you can also check out other services that are offered as well. So Capricorn, let's start in the read and let's find out the answer. What is going to be the future of this connection? Plus, I will also be adding one oracle card towards the end of the week. So stay tuned. And now let's see the future of this connection that you have on your mind. Let's find out. King of Swords. Ten of uh, Wands. The Moon. The High Priestess. I feel like you know you have very high expectation out of this connection. You're really believing strongly in the divine timing around it. Uh, to be honest, I feel like, you know, whoever it is that you're currently dealing with, they have a lot of baggage to deal with. They have a lot of, uh, you know, uh, responsibilities to deal with. They have a lot of past patterns to break free from. They have a lot of karmic cycles to break free from. So I feel like, you know, there is a lot to happen before you could have what you want with this person. I do see that this connection seems to be very strong. For some of you, you might be dealing with water signs. Uh, but I feel like, you know, there is a lot of uh, intuitiveness that you feel for this connection. You feel like, you know, there is a soulfulness in this connection that you have with your person. Even though uh, things are not smooth, even though things are not pleasant right now between the two of you, maybe your person is not accepting your love, maybe they are not accepting to receive or give love to you right now, but you are, strong, uh, you know, staying very strong around it. And I feel like, you know, this connection has a lot of, uh, you know, issues going on in this connection right now. I don't see anything happy, I don't see anything positive that you might be dealing with in regards to this connection right now with your person. Um, I feel like you know it's pretty much one-sided connection as of now because I, I don't see your person's energy here. It's more of one person's energy here into this connection. Um, let me see what is it that they have on their mind about you. I feel like you know this person has a lot of control over this connection because uh, it's, it's more like you know... Um, You, if, if you really want this connection to work, I think you have to basically win over their heart. And right now, their heart is closed off to love. Basically, they are not ready to receive or give love right now. They have a lot of uh, mental, physical, emotional blocks, which is making this person to stay away from you right now. Um, let's see the oracle guidance around it. What do you need to do? I don't see things changing here anytime soon coming from this person's end. But let's see, what is it that you need to do to have what you desire? Capricorns. A new start is coming, communication is the key, and luck is going to be on your side, prosperity lies ahead. I feel like, you know, things might change um, unexpectedly. Now, I feel like, you know, for a majority of you, your person, um, how would that happen? Let's see. It's going to be a sudden change. Um, some sort of uh, divine inclination uh, and intervention coming from your person's end. I feel like you know, somehow they're in, you know, their connection with the divine is going to get stronger and they will feel in some sort of inclination towards you. It's going to be more like a um, divine guidance which is going to lead them towards you, which is going to happen in the in coming uh, future. I feel like, you know, and that's going to be a new era that you're going to be having with this person after that inclination and uh, intuition that, that, uh, that, that your person is going to have um, you know, um, the, the, the intuition that your person is going to receive around um, this connection that they have with you, it's going to bring them towards you. So I feel like, you know, a new start is coming in and that is going to be unexpected for you to receive because if you see this current connection right now with your person, it's pretty much one-sided. Out of nowhere, this person will start giving into the connection and they will start communicating with you freely and openly. It is going to be a sudden shift. So I do see a new era in your love life with this person coming up very soon. Um, and that's going to be like most, uh, you know, for most of you, it's going to be a divine um, 
reward for you for your love for your efforts into this connection that you might experience coming up so that's pretty much just coming up for you for this read if it helped you do like share and subscribe delay the next read for you guys take care bye